wanted to make this little video regarding all the hoopla recently over the the uh, interview and the article in GQ magazine about Phil Robertson and I just wanted to say that unlike most people I've actually read the entire article and I am appalled by this article GQ originally stands for Gentleman's Quarterly later changed to GQ just because they made it a monthly publication anyway if this is a gentleman's publication, why were there many, many four-letter words in this article? A gentleman never swears, but yet there are these profane words that are in this article. Furthermore, the author of the article tried to put Phil and his beliefs in a bad light. They should be respectful of him and what he stands for. The fact that people don't even look at that is upsetting to me. The fact that America, the media, has allowed the liberal news media to come out with articles saying against what Phil said about gays. If you read the article, it's a very lengthy article. There is very little about gays in there. It's mostly about his life and what Duck Dynasty has changed his life into and the hunting and all the, all the things that are associated with the popularity of the TV show. The article is not about gays. But yet, the media picks out a couple pieces, and the little part that they did not mention, that Phil mentioned about gays, that they just happen to overlook, is the fact that he says that he does not judge them, and he wants them to believe the gospel. His preaching in this article was primarily focused on the need of America to repent, on them, their need to trust in Jesus as their Savior, as atonement for their sins, in order to receive eternal life. No one mentions that. All they care about is this gay agenda thing, and then all the, the hoopla over that. All Phil was doing was saying what the Word of God, the Bible, says. If you got a problem with that, then you got a problem with God, and you got a problem with God's Word. You don't have a problem with Phil Robertson. And I'm just appalled that America has sunk to the level that an article with four-letter profane words in it and an article that demeans the person that they are interviewing and their beliefs comes out, no one says a word about that. And yet they continue to bash Phil Robertson over him just simply stating what the Bible says. This shows how bad America is off. And America needs to stop listening to the liberal news media and instead let the Bible and God's Word be their guide. Believe in Jesus death as atonement for their sins and believe the the instructions, the doctrine written in Paul's epistles, Romans through Philemon, in order for this nation to turn around. And then the, as Phil says, you know, he's not judging the gays, the natural result will be the gays turning from their sins and living a lifestyle pleasing to Christ. And the fact that America doesn't even care about that is what's appalling to me.